Hey everybody, it's Matt with Max Video. Lord, my hair is a mess. Yeah, that'll work. Anyway, <laughs> um, today we're doing a game review. Um, as apparently is my style now, it is a phone game, but not your traditional phone game. Today we will be reviewing Vain Glory. Now, uh, Vain Glory is, I think, the category of game is like lane defense. It's in the same style as a uh, Dota, League of Legends, uh, Heroes of the Storm, kinda like that but on a phone. That being said, it is a little more simple than those other games I mentioned. That being that you have one lane and a jungle. That is it. Pretty simple. Um, and for those of you that don't know those kind of games, um, essentially, you have one side of the map, your opponent has the other side of the map. You choose a hero based out of the pool of heroes available, and you try to get to the other person's base and destroy their shrine, temple, altar, or in this case, their vein, um, which is a giant crystal. Um, and you have to... Um, Fight the other heroes, you have to fight defenses such as towers. In this case, you have these gigantic artillery things that are a beast to take down and fight against. Um, and the way it works, the leveling system in these kind of games is the more you earn experience wise, that's when you get to unlock your abilities, you get to level them up, you get, I you get gold to buy items with to strengthen you, that kind of thing. Um, the thing I like about this game is that there's two different play uh, play um, options. Uh, you have your normal um, type of game, which takes you anywhere from 20 to 30 minutes. Usually 30 minutes, let's be honest. Um, then you have the, I believe it's Battle Royale is what it's called, and that's more of a short term. It speeds everything up. It automatically gives you um, a lot of experience at the beginning, a lot of gold, so you're able to get everything that you need early, thus speeding the game up, because that's what the first 10 to 15 minutes is anyway, is getting your basic attacks, your basic abilities, the items you need. So they kind of eliminate that in the Battle Royale. Um, so it's a little quicker, because who has, you know, 30 minutes to kill? all the time. They're very smart in the fact that they did that. Um, also, uh, it's very easy to get into this game. There's not a lot of tricky stuff to it. It does come with a tutorial that you have to do when you first start in there, and it teaches you literally everything you need to know. Everything. So you can't say that the game didn't try to help. And you have a lot of things you can do through the experience you gain per round. They give you cards and stuff. Uh, you can use the cards to get more skins. Um, it gives you different currency systems in the game. There are in-game purchases that you can do. Um, so it's if you want to, you know, do completely no money spent, you can do it. If you want to uh, spend money, if that's the kind of thing you do. It's there. Go for it. Do you. Um, some of the cons that I have with this is, good lord, it sucks your battery life like it's a leech. Like, one round can suck half a battery. But a lot's going on. It also is a lot of storage space. A lot. I can't tell you the exact number, but I had to delete like four apps just to fit it. So... That's a thought. Is it enough to warrant not getting in the game? No, because we all have apps on our phone we don't need. I didn't need piano tiles. I didn't. I, yeah. I still had all the Lifeline games on there. I've beat them. I don't need them. So, yeah. So it's a really good game. And they have, um, clans that you can do, 
where you can, you know, join up with your friends and, you know, play like that, kind of like the guilds and stuff and all your MMOs. So it's a really fun game, and it's a really uh, easy game to get into, not a lot to worry about with it, you know. So, yeah, and it is created by the, I'm going to say it's Mega, Super Evil Megacorp. Super Evil Megacorp. That name is awesome. Man, that's awesome. And it is a uh, free-to-play in the, you know, the in-game purchases. That's where your money is going to go if you do that. Um, but it is a free app. You don't have to worry about that. And it's very, I don't know. This style of gaming is very popular. I mean, look at League of Legends, look at Dota 2. They have tournaments for this. People professionally play this style of gaming. So you know it's something you can get into. I mean, it's not my favorite style of game, but I like playing it, especially with my friends. It's a lot of fun that way. So, yeah. As far as I know, it's on um, Google, it's on the app, it's on the uh, Play Store. I don't know if it's on the App Store for Apple. I assume it would be, but like I said, I don't have an Apple, so I can't tell you for sure. But check it out. You won't regret it. And if you do, I'm sorry. Love you. See you on the next one.